tomorrow. Britain's Air Force sees service in many parts of the world, and so do these Royal Air Force police dogs. They're all thoroughbred Alsatians trained to the minute, and this is their leader, Storm, a five-year-old white Alsatian. Like the rest, he's a regular service type, complete with number tattooed on left ear. They're specially bred and trained at Staverton in Gloucestershire. Training begins at the age of 12 months and lasts for six weeks for handler and dog. After training, they're posted to stations in the United Kingdom for six months and then return to Staverton for classification into proper service grades. This is a very special routine designed to ferret out natives in the Middle East who burrow like rabbits under the aerodrome wires. The dogs are taught to drive them out of it and tunnelling work is an excellent preliminary. When training is complete, they're ready for anything from attack by sticks to gunfire. When posted, their handlers automatically go with them. Hello, what's this? It looks as if a little action is called for. By day or night, he can smell out an intruder better than his handler could hope to, and once he's on the scent, nothing will stop him. The criminal in this case is Sergeant Justice, and by now he must be having doubts about the job. Luckily, the dog is well trained, and a word from his handler is enough to call him off. It looks like a complete surrender. Aha, a tricky customer, but he won't get far. To any self-respecting thief, the sight of a policeman must be very welcome after being at close quarters with such an adversary. This time, he's really had enough. So, happy landings to Britain's dogs of war. <laughs>